What up, guys? FIFA Bros 101 here, and uh, today we've got an amazing squad builder. You guys will not believe what kind of squad this is. Um, of course, as you can see, in, as uh, the squad name, you can see that we do have a really expensive player in the squad. But for some reason, the squad works out together. But if, in first and goal, we've got Julio Cesar. To be honest, he's the worst player in this squad. Um, I can't seem to use him to his full potential because he just doesn't work for me. I like to throw uh, balls down the, the wings to the winger sometimes, but he just cannot throw for to save his life. So, I, in a way, I don't really recommend him, but in a way, if you need a Brazilian keeper, I guess he's the best one. Uh, but I've used um, Man of the Match Victor, and he's really good. I recommend him. Um, center back, we already know about David Luiz. We already know that EA practically f's the shit out of him and we don't really need to talk about him right back we've got a standard right back we've got aspi Laqueta. um he does the job <clears throat> uh first center mid we've got ramirez who's one of my favorite uh center mids in the game he is so fast he's lightning fast and he's got a rocket shot for me so i really really recommend ramirez right forward we've got man of the match moses I have his regular, which is just as good. If you do want a little bit more pace, I guess you can go for the man of the match. Just under the 50k mark. He's a really, really fast player. So the the state just totally lie on his card. 85 pace is not his pace. He has like 95 pace. It's amazing. Um, other center back starting to get into the La Liga side. We've got Pepe. He does the job. He actually did better for me than uh, David Luiz. He scored four goals in ten games for me. That's amazing for a center back. Um, I was surprised because I usually suck when I use Pepe, but he did the job this time. Left back, we've got, uh, surprisingly, I've never used him in this game, but I use him in FIFA 12, um, Marcelo. Everyone probably knows how good he is. He's probably one of the best left backs in the game, if not the best. This guy attacks the wings, and he comes back to play defense, which is amazing. Um... So our left center mid is, oh no, I'm sorry, to, from the middle of the, the the field, the best, well not the best, the second best player in my squad, to believe it or not, I thought he would be the crappiest, Andre Santos, this guy is absolutely amazing, he scored two bicycle kicks for me, or maybe overhead kicks, and he scored an amazing dipping long shot for me, I absolutely recommend him, the best thousand coins you'll ever spend in your life. So my left center mid is probably the crappiest center mid out of all of them. I don't really like Kaka in this game. I thought he was kind of bad. He had good long shots, but he does better in a center attacking mid position, in my opinion. But striker, my maybe top three favorite strikers of all time in FIFA history. Odom Wingy, oh my god, I have the best goal ratio with this guy. It's incredible. I've got 45 goals in 55 games, which is absolutely amazing. But, um, yeah, that's him. He's just a tank. I absolutely make, recommend him. Good for handicap as well, <laughs> if that makes, if that even exists. But left forward, you already guessed it. We have Cristiano Ronaldo, who I bought for one point, 150k, which is absolutely insane for one player. I think he's overpriced, but you can see the stats. He scored 12 goals in 13 games for me. Absolute legend. But, yep, that's pretty much it. Enjoy the goals. Uh, please comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.